Good morning, y'all. Welcome or welcome back to another video. And I think to myself, what a wonderful. I know it's been a fat, fatty minute since I've picked up a camera, recorded anything. I tried to do a vlog, when was it? Two weeks ago, I think, and it was okay, but honestly, it just kind of got away from me. I forgot to film, and I was just busy, and, you know, life happens, so I'm trying it again. Hopefully, this one makes it to YouTube. But here we are, and honestly, I'm really excited to just be filming something again, just because it's so fun for me, and we, we all need to have a little fun, so. Today is just going to be a little day in my life. I am in a new place in many things like in life in general and physically i'm in a new apartment so i will be showing i guess just a little bit of that not like a huge apartment tour but just a little bit and i'm working right now i started full time this week today's tuesday so yesterday was my first day full time this is my first week and i am just so excited so many exciting things happening life is just taken off and lots of perspective change and i'm excited so right now i'm currently working all this week i'm working from home basically today i'm going in for a little bit just to help out a co-worker but after that i am home rest of the week which is so nice because last week was so incredibly busy we had events every single day last week and then i jumped at texas relays this past weekend so that was so much fun and honestly i'm just really happy with how i did i can't really complain about it my family was in town and we also celebrated my birthday last weekend and there was just lots going on so this week is definitely a rest and relax week it's gonna be peaceful it's been peaceful so far and I just, I don't know, taking time for myself and it feels so, so good. But today I just have work and I will take y'all along and I also need to do my workout later, whenever that is. And then I also have Bible study tonight at 6.30 and that's basically going to be it for the day. <laughs> Already, I took off my sweater I was wearing because it's hot outside and I walked to work so did not want to sweat but I'm ready to head into the office I finished up my breakfast watched some YouTube and worked all at the same time I'm ready to go and let's get this walk it takes me like 25 30 minutes to walk to work so I really hope I don't get there all sweaty because that's not fun but let's go I'm back from work. It is five o'clock and I am changed and ready to go to my workout. It is just a quick like general strength sort of workout so should be pretty fast and I need to go knock that out because I have Bible study at 630 so we need to go do that and I also need to stop at HEB to get something so let's go Thank 
study my practice was great and I did not film anything at home because I had to very quickly rush shower like super fast change and then skirt off to Bible study but I just got out I stopped at Target to pick up something and I think I'm gonna go over to one of my friends houses I don't know we're supposed to eat dinner or I was gonna pick up dinner and then we were gonna eat, but I haven't heard anything. So I guess we will see. But yeah, Bible study was so good and I love going. I, I get so excited on Tuesdays to go. Like I love going and I look forward to it every week. I just highly encourage getting involved with like some sort of community and stuff because it's just so much fun to have a solid group of people that share your faith and that you can walk with. Okay, and here's a little bit of it for my car, so I might have I am finally back home. I'm laying in my bed, my amazing, comfortable bed, and I am so tired. I think it's like 10.30ish, and I have to get up for work tomorrow. I don't know if I'm gonna lift in the morning or not, like before work. Still gonna figure that out. But I need to do some stretching and stuff before I go to bed, so I'm going to do that. I've got New Girl on the TV, which New Girl is getting taken off of Netflix April 9th. Why would they do that? Why would they do such a thing? New Girl is my comfort show. It is my absolute favorite show. And the fact that it's getting taken off of Netflix really triggers me. And they better put it on another streaming site because if not, I'm going to be really sad and I will riot. I will riot. And that's that. Dragon with the right leg forward. And let's focus on our breathing. This will be a passive as you allow your body weight to rest on your left thigh and to full capacity towards the left. Keep your shoulders down to be a simple one minute held position. Please give me one minute. I just finished my stretching and the app I use is called Pliability and you do have to pay for it monthly, but honestly, it's so worth it. And if you just like, get in a routine with it it helps so much and it just feels so good to just stretch your body every day so that's the app that i use and so far i love it i've had it for about a month now i think i'm pretty consistent with it um there's only some times where like i don't do it or i'm too tired to do it or forget to do it or something like that but for the most part i've been sticking with it and I really like it. I guess this is kind of like a part of my night routine. Like I always stretch at night before I go to sleep and then the last thing I do before I lay in bed and turn the lights off and everything for the night is my like daily devotionals. I have the I have the Holy Bible app and it just gives you a verse every day, a verse of the day along with a little um like speech ish or like talk about it and then like a little prayer thing to follow up with it and it takes 
not super long honestly you can make it take as long as you want it could be as short as five minutes or as long as 10 15 20 minutes just depending on i guess how long you want to pray and just meditate on it how much time you have really um but i like to do it before bed and oh, why can't words i can't form words right now and it's just easiest for me to do it at night because that's just typically when i have the most time to myself and easiest to stay in that routine so i am gonna do my devotional before i go to bed and then that's it good morning y'all it is the next day i am sitting here on my couch working from home i've got my breakfast which is just a bagel and some fruit these bagels are actually like keto bagels and my parents bring them for me whenever they come to visit because there's this like keto bakery sort of thing by their house and they have i swear some of the best blueberry muffins and they're all keto and delicious and i am obsessed with them so they always bring me some whenever they come visit and they were here this last weekend so they brought me some and it was so good i'm just sitting here playing some new girl on the tv doing some work and eating and then i need to make some coffee or matcha i'm not sure which one i'm leaning towards Shit, we got a song right that's gonna give you the best damn oral you have <laughs> All I know is We could go anywhere we could do Anything go whatever the moon we're in yeah, All I know is Getting lost late at night on the stars Finding love standing right where we are Your lips They pull me in the moment You and I alone And people may be watching I just got back into my apartment. I went down to my apartment gym so I could do my lift and they had everything I needed minus a few improvises, but it was good and I'm glad I got to do that on my little lunch break. And that is basically it. I have to go practice, do my running after I get out of work today, but I've just been sitting here drinking coffee, working, all that good stuff. I am just gonna eat some lunch real fast. I did some meal prepping the other night, so I've got some salad with tofu on it and all that good stuff. And I might eat or drink a smoothie or something later. I don't really know, but we will see. So I am gonna do that and I'm really hungry, so. So here's my lunch with my dressing and tofu salad. i am got my work going, new girl in the back and my iced coffee. I'm obsessed with these cups. My sister-in-law got them for me for my birthday and I'm in love with them. So this is my little setup and I'm gonna keep working. I just got a package and I ordered this a couple weeks ago or like a week and a half ago I think as a birthday present for myself and I just got it. It just got delivered and we're gonna do a little unboxing. It is from Chamberlain Coffee because I love Emma Chamberlain and I love her coffee brand, so I ordered some things from there. First, we've got this little cold brew um, variety pack, so they're single serves. Well, I guess you could do hot or cold, honestly, so I get to try all the different coffee flavors, so that's really exciting, and then I can figure out my favorite, and then... I ordered just a bag of the original blend just because I've always wanted to try her coffee. I have her hot chocolate and it's really good and I wanted to try the coffee. So, And then lastly, I ordered a cup and I have a really bad cup obsession. I don't know what it is about cups that I am just in love with. Um, couldn't tell you what it is, but I am obsessed with all cups. 
And this one was just too cute for me to pass up. And, oh my gosh, I like my two favorite colors right here. Green and cream, tan, I don't know. But this is so cute. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to use this. This makes me so happy for no reason. I cannot wait to try this. I'm trying some tomorrow. So that will be very fun. Also, tomorrow I think I'm going to a coffee shop with one of my friends. So that'll be good. Anyways, time to get back to work. And then I, I need to finish what I'm doing so that way I can take a short little break to whip up some banana bread and then get back to it. <laughs> okay, so I got another package. I ordered something off Amazon two days ago and it just got here. I opened it already because I couldn't wait. But in it, I had a pack of four, just little, ooh, it's about to fall, like little 16 ounce glass bottles. And I am already using one of them. And I also ordered a pack of liquid IV. I got the passion fruit flavor, but I just simply do not drink enough water and I'm trying to be so much better at it. And I didn't even like, read it but it says add to 16 ounces of water and these are 16 ounces so worked out perfectly i'm using one right now to drink some liquid iv to get some extra hydration because i'm gonna go run when i get off of work in like 30 minutes so drinking one of these and i just think they're so cute and i love that they have a little handle on the top and they're just cute little glass bottles I'm probably gonna fill, I might use two of them for like infused water, like do fill them with water and put lemons, cucumbers, strawberries, whatever in them. And then I think I will keep two of them just for like liquid IV. So, trying to work on that hydration. And my banana bread is ready, I can hear my alarm. Let's check my banana bread. Ooh, yum. Oh my gosh, I wish y'all could smell this because it smells so good. So it is now like 10.30 p.m. I went and did my workout when I got off of work and then I had to rush home real fast and change and stuff because I had a friend that came over and I made some banana bread and stuff and it turned out so good. I am really happy with that recipe and I'm glad that I finally found like a good recipe. Actually, my friend sent it to me because she made banana bread the other, the other day and brought me some and then I asked her for that recipe and then she gave it to me. So I made it and it was funny because they literally tasted the exact same, like turned out exactly the same and stuff, which I mean, yes, makes sense because it's the same recipe, but still sometimes things taste different i don't know anyways it was such a fun night we just hung out ate some banana bread drank some tea and it was just a lot of fun and made plans for later on so super excited i found out that one of my favorite bakeries is here like they have a location here and i had no idea until she told me about it so really excited to go there next time and yeah, I did my stretching for the night already. I just finished up my devotional on the Holy Bible app. I love it so, so much. I cannot recommend this daily devotional enough. And I got, oh, I think I already showed you actually, but I'm using my new cup and I am so, so, so obsessed with it. So it's just so aesthetically pleasing to me. It just, it's just so nice. And my ice is still in here, has not melted at all. It's been such a good day. I, you know, just worked from home and relaxed. And I am just learning to enjoy just the peacefulness of being home and 
just focusing on things that make me happy and doing things that I want to do and doing things that I enjoy and things that bring me joy. So learning to count on myself for my own happiness and I have just been getting better and I love that. Learning to love just being with myself and learning a lot of things. I'm sure I'll touch on things in a whole other video. That's going to have to be a whole other sit down video. I'm going to have to make notes and everything about it. So that's to come, but not till later. Still learning stuff. So yeah, that's going to be further down the line. But anyways, that is my video. It was a little two days in my life. It turned out to be two instead of one, so we'll see how long this video actually is. I have no idea. It was so much fun picking up the camera again and just vlogging a little bit, and I'm excited to start making more videos, being more consistent with things, and it's going to be fun. I'm just going to, you know, do my thing. Until next time, I hope it was kind of peaceful. I don't know. Honestly, I don't I don't know what the vibes of this video are, to be honest with you. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed my video because I enjoyed making it. And thank y'all so much for watching. And I will see y'all in my next video. Good night. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world.